Welcome guys to another Microsoft Flight Sim video. Today we're going to be trying to take off and land the Cessna 172S, which is a water airplane. This is going to be really interesting. I've uh, done only one landing with it. It's pretty difficult, but, but I'll get a hang of it. Let's go full throttle. And it's a really interesting fun takeoff because, yeah, it's you don't really, really see this kind of things. And like, uh, because, yeah, no. Well, most videos don't cover these kind of airplanes. Anyway, so we can begin taking off at like 60 knots. Uh, announce takeoff. And yep, we can uh, ascend. Now it's time for our descent very soon. And this is basically how it goes. You know, it's, it's pretty interesting though. I, I, I quite like it. I like the gameplay, the mechanics. So we'll go F2 and we'll go down to zero. Uh, let's change the trajectory a little bit. Oh, what has our gorgeous today? And we can land very easily. Oh, that was a good landing, I'd say. Oh, um, yep. Uh, uh, I hope we don't. Yeah. That was interesting. Let's go up to some bigger airplanes now. That, that took very little time. And by the way, if you're enjoying this video so far, you might want to consider subscribing because that helps me out a ton. I'm trying to get to 100 subs before 2023 and it will be amazing if you could subscribe. Okay, let's get back to the main menu and let's see what we can find. So now I'm thinking about some larger airplanes. Uh, Cessna 172, relatively small craft. Let's, let's see, uh, what else have we got? Uh, Cessna 172, obviously. Uh, we've got a Pilatus, which is slightly bigger, 115 knots, 4 hours. Oh, okay, so, let's see, what else? What else have we got? We've got, okay, we've got this, this is, uh, one of the big boys. Uh, yeah, that, that's the biggest one around here. We're also going for a different airport. Let's see. Let's go for, um, Diving Rock, I feel like. Or Lake Monroe. Let's go for Lake Monroe. I feel like Lake Monroe is, like, the best one out there for these kind of landings. Zero seven I Lake Monroe. Zero Okay, so right about here, we've got Lake Monroe. Uh, interesting. We'll pick up the runway. We'll set it as our arrival airport. And let's see. How does it turn out? Yep. Uh, 1,667 feet. Sounds good. Sounds good. But it's a pretty, pretty big plane, so uh, we'll see. We'll see. Okay, uh, it's KBFR. We've got our single seater here. And okay, this is going to be interesting. It's the Cub Crafters X, which is, oh no, it's so hard to control already. I can already feel it being hard to control. <laughs> that, that's just unfortunate. We'll have to open the VFR map here. KBFR is very close by. The, the problem is, uh, it's a water airport, and it's in Lake Monroe, and Lake Monroe ain't big enough. It ain't big enough. Oh, and we know Simon. We, we don't have a chance. What? Just, okay. Uh, um, maybe, maybe we should be going to try going for some other airport. Let's go for Lake Hamilton Lake. How about that? Uh, it's arrival airport, 01F, F, Hamilton Lake, Hamilton, let's fly, 2400 feet, not gonna be the easiest, but okay, oh, let's see, here we go, and okay, already feeling it, it quite difficult, yeah, it's quite difficult to control this. We'll see. 
So it's like right there. Okay, okay. We're going way too fast. I mean, and I usually don't do that. I have it on like chill. Uh, 500 knots on a uh, 200 knot cruising speed. Who cares? Then I realize we're no sliding. And then I realize, oh, well, that might, that might not might be um slightly not ideal. Just slightly not ideal. But it's fine. <laughs> Why? Because it's so difficult to control this plane. Like, the Cessna is like, ease, or you, you don't need to do anything. Why aren't we going down? Let's set it to zero degrees. Why is the throttle this weird? Oh my god, why is, is the throttle automatically adjusting? I'm not adjusting it back. The throttle is just like, oh, let me adjust back. Oh, hell. Hell, oh, this is, this is just sad. Oh, this just hurts. This is, this is hurting. Oh, this is painful. Oh, this hurts me so bad. We're gonna store any second now. We, we gotta go up a little bit more. God damn it. Oh no. Oh, and we're crashing. Oh, this is unfortunate. Okay. But how about we try some takeoffs? Okay, maybe it, it works better with takeoffs. Let's go for. Uh. Um. Luck view desert. 16W1 um 16W1 oh uh 16NJ a WI here we go in the faults this is gonna be our last flight uh, did I send it send it as a start, departure I hope I did I really hope I did but this is gonna be our last flight. It's gonna be interesting. Ready to fly. Oh no. Miserable weather. I love it. Huh. This is just gonna be unfortunate. Well, at least we've got steering. We're in a freaking desert and it's raining. I love it. We're in a large lake in the middle of a desert. You know, uh, as one is. How about, how about we just strike? Yeah, turn around. Ooh, that, that would be pretty cool. Ooh, we're drifting. Drifting in Microsoft Flight Simulator, Pong. <laughs> Why are we actually able to drift? What the heck? What the heck is wrong with this game? Oh, can we, can we take off? This, this is awkward. Okay. Uh, successful take off, I'd say. And they're gonna stall any second now. Yeah, oh, we have amazing visibility. Don't you all love this game? Oh, look at look at the look at the amazing visibility. Uh, uh, can we just yeah, not 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 instantly um crash into something? Okay, will, will this be long enough? But we'll have to find out very soon in the day. No, the, this episode. Definitely this episode. Don't worry, guys. It's chill. Okay, uh, okay, pull back up, pull back up, pull back up. Um, oh, that was a successful landing. Th there's an error with the game. Uh, that was actually a successful landing. On that, and on that note, um, thanks for watching. Uh, I hope you enjoyed this video. I really do hope you enjoyed this video. Like, uh, subscribe. Uh, it was fun. P pretty fun. Yep, yep, totally, totally. Yep, fun. Uh, oh, it was so fun. Uh, anyways, yeah, thanks. Bye.